Hello YouTube, Mewtwo back with another gameplay and this is going to be a gameplay of my recent reproduction for Tears of Opa Opa and that is Black Belt 2 slash Fist of the North Star slash Hotaku no Ken or something like that. Well basically it's Fist of the North Star as, as far as I can tell. Um, so let's get on with it. There we go, of course it's in Japanese. It's the Japanese version of Black Belt, in case anyone's wondering. Um, and from what I understand, there are some difference in skinning and content. Uh, the, the Western release had uh, some of the... Oh, get out of here! Don't get my ass kicked. Uh, had some of the kind of Fist of North Star content or references reduced. But I'm, by now, I'm not an expert on that. Um, with the way people are um, exploding through this guy's fists, uh, it certainly would be a more fitting title. I didn't realize this is what having a black belt enabled you to do. Well, it's tricky enough when you're not used to it. Uh, I've only played a little when I when I was testing out the reproduction and I couldn't get past the first level so to be honest I'm not expecting to get past the first level here. Uh, it reminds me as well more of Kung Fu style game, you know, singular plane. Um, you, you can punch, kick and you can you know, change the elevation of your kicks but I find it's just better to kick. Nope, get out, get out. There we go. So there's quite a few mini bosses, it seems, too. Uh, their opening certainly suggested that there's more levels, and given that this is chapter one, still, uh, I'm low on health, too. I, I'd imagine it does change scenario. Clearly, a dystopian future there in the background. And one of those buildings, just where I'm standing now, is very uh, interestingly shaped, shall we say? Oh, he was easy. Nope. Oh. You really don't want to let them get up close to you or you're in trouble. But thankfully, most guys are one-hit kills. And they're definitely going with the numbers over intelligence uh, approach. Oh, sounds like it's time for boss. Yeah, this is the boss I can never get past. Toby. I'm never even sure if I'm hitting him. It looks like you hit him there. And one time I think I was getting close with my time. <laughs> okay, we'll give him one more shot and call it a day then. Um, I doubt I'll get past it, so there's no point kind of beating a dead horse. It's a fairly, you could say repetitive, you know, hook to the right, kick, kick, kick. Personally, um, there's other games where I would prefer to walk to the right and kick. But uh, if you have a, you know nostalgia for Black Belt, I'd, I'd imagine it would be an enjoyable title. And here we go. Time to kick Tubby in the face again. I find it a bit awkward that up is jump. I always hate that controls, but... It's a common problem with uh, limited button schemes. Even worse on getting uh, Commodore and uh, single button systems. Typically the mass system had a jump button because it had two buttons, two whole buttons. But uh, Fisted North Star is so complicated, it needs more. So repeat, 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 and hope he dies. I'm guessing not. I'm guessing I'm doing something wrong, because no one else took this amount of hits. Now, it's possible he's kind of like a boss character, so you know, he takes more, but eventually he just wears me down in terms of patience. Get out of here, you bugger.
Yeah, oh, come on. Do, 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 do. Anyway, we'll leave it there, because undoubtedly the same thing will happen again. Not sure I'd personally recommend the game myself. It seems fairly um, simplistic, as they watch me kick my ass. I personally put this down as collectors only, especially the Japanese version. Um, well, most definitely a reproduction, but however, that's my uh, my own opinion. Maybe if I knew what I was doing more, it would be more enjoyable, or just got past level one. So, thanks as always for watching, and we'll see you again in another video shortly. Bye.